the greenhouse is uh, moved high on the priority list. We need it to start seeds. We also bought like a hundred trees or trees and plants. So bushes, um, apple trees. We're doing a whole uh, permaculture type orchard, which is gonna go in here, but we wanna keep the trees in the greenhouse, I think all summer and then plant in the, um, in the fall, just because we won't have the ground ready yet. We've also got a lead on a dump truck full of manure, which will be coming. So we can mix that up, manure, hay, trying to find some compost and just uh, kind of do a no dig type garden for the, for the uh, floor of the greenhouse as well as the orchard. The barn tear down behind me is gonna be on hold, but we've salvaged enough boards that we can do this entire wall, um, roof on this side of the greenhouse. So that's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna get some of these boards on and uh, just keep plugging away at this. Once I get this side done, it'll add a little bit more stability and then we can get going on the greenhouse uh, plastic side. Well, we got this side done. I think it looks pretty good. We're still gonna put the metal on there, add some more support, and then eventually we're gonna build a lean-to, probably till about here, say 10 feet out, the entire way, and it'll just be an area where we can kind of store garden stuff. It's also gonna act as most of our wind comes this way. If we have kind of some posts and more supports here, just help prevent this thing from tipping over in the future. Because I don't have all the, uh, only that one wall done, it is a little bit wobbly still. So I bought some 12 foot boards the other day. I'm gonna go grab those, put along the edge just to give some support. And I think we do have a little storm coming or it's the Windy Island homestead. There's always wind. quite a bit of wobble this way. Once I throw some more supports in here and get this, you know, the siding and the panels on, it'll help a lot. But until then, I'm gonna put one of these boards up across uh, because I really don't want this thing to fall down. Let's do the same on the other side. And that snow is starting to come down. So we're getting 15 centimeters tonight. It's a nice enough day. We're gonna get the greenhouse panels on today. Two by 12 foot length, so we should be able to get this all done today, I'm thinking. We haven't spent any money, except for some screws on the greenhouse, just repurposing things we find around the, around the property. So, we were okay with spending a little bit of money on the panels themselves. So, I'm gonna get these brought over. We'll get our first one up, have a look at it. Uh, I think the first one's really important to get it nice and level, and then we'll just see how it goes.
These are the end caps. Prevents wind, I believe, so it can't lift off. And maybe critters from getting in there. Uh, we also got some s screws. These ones are, they have like a little rubber gasket in them. Holy, that's on there. You can see that. A little washer and then like a rubber gasket to keep the rain out, make a weather seal. I think the plan first is to, because we have wind that goes this direction. So because we're gonna have an overlap in the middle, I'm gonna want put the furthest one on first and then have this one overlap just so wind can't you know get underneath and catch it and tear it apart so I think what I'll do is I'll climb up there I'll put a couple screws on there just to kind of get it because I gotta do all this by myself just so I can get it up there and then I'll climb up on the ladder and with the panel and put it put it up there and arrange it and get it all level and square and all that stuff Okay, that's all I'm doing today. I gotta head to the store, get some more screws before I can throw a couple more panels. Right along the bottom here, I think I'm gonna put, because I still have a couple of the 12 footers left, so I'm gonna put two more of the 12 footers. Uh, so that'll be all, this is our south wall. This will be almost all covered. And then just a board at the bottom. And then that'll leave me with a 12 footer and a bunch of, uh, you know, three, ooh, a bunch of three footers left. And I'm just gonna do, what I can a little bit right here and then the rest will all just be barn board and the door and stuff so um, yeah I think that's all I'm gonna do today turned out pretty good definitely add some stability to the greenhouse too. getting there one step at a time thanks for watching guys see you next time